Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. What's up, folks? We're back with more Game Over Cancer. I'm Rift20XX, and with me I have the legendary Stormcrow 56k for commentary. Oh. <laughs> uh, and this is TMNT, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, on the NES. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but this is the only Ninja Turtle single-player side-scrolling action platformer. Uh, on the NES, at least. Uh, I think there's a couple on Game Boy, but after this, it, it's pretty much all... Arcade beat em up style, eh? Yeah, yeah, we, we don't talk about the DOS versions too much. It, uh, wow, but DOS? <laughs> well, <laughs> other than that, yeah. Alright, uh, so I'm not gonna waste much time here. We'll, we'll get started. I'm gonna try this audio cue at, at the very beginning, we call the magic start button. And what I'm trying to do is get the Technodrome to spawn in. The, the path of least resistance, I guess, the, the faster route, uh, because in the second and the last stage, the Technodrome can spawn in one of three locations. Well, well one of them is, is very good for a speedrun. The other two are very not. <laughs> so I'm going to try to get that, I guess. Get some blesses in chat. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, timer starts now, I guess. When I gain control of Leonardo, I'm s stuck in a hole here. Okay, yeah. <laughs> timer, whatever. And we're dead. <laughs> and we're... Oh, no. This is actually Reset terrible. Reset percent. <laughs> nah, it's all right. We can, we can survive with one turtle down. So, uh, starting off here, uh, Rift is going to be making it to the... Okay, is this Rocksteady or Bebop fight? Bebop. Bebop, yeah. I have a little bit of a delay watching his stream. Yeah. Um, yeah, so if you notice here, he's taking damage. So the idea is to get below half health, which you see he's, he's just right underneath there. And you actually deal extra damage, um, depending on the turtle. And Donatello has the most damage uh, out of all the turtles as well, and the best range. So, um, important we do that immediately. Uh, for instance, this guy right here, he takes two hits with the less than half damage. He takes three hits if you're over half damage. Um, so we're going to be utilizing that throughout the run. Um, coming up here, we got some really tight jumps. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Okay, so there's a little <laughs> trick you can do. And you can actually let go uh, of the right direction or left. Um, at the right after you jump, I think it's like one or two frames after you jump on those uh, conveyor belts, and it'll shoot you across. So he was going for uh, a slingshot. Very tight. <laughs> yeah. All right, rock steady down. We saved our girlfriend. <laughs> I can't believe I killed Leo right at the beginning. <laughs> Let's go, Cowabunga. Right? Oh, yeah, it's roadkill percent, oh. not reset percent. Where am I going? There we go. I think that's okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Right. Reset up for the clip. Nice. Got it. <laughs> so we're going to be util utilizing these clips throughout the run as well. If you're at the exact right position, you can clip up as long as it's, um, I think it has to be only one tile thick. If it's two tiles thick, like on the top to bottom, I won't allow you to. Because of Leo, I'm grabbing this pizza just for swimming. I'm not climbing this little ladder. It's a matter of pride. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, respect. So, yeah, I also forgot get... to start my own timer. Well, <laughs> <laughs> night good. shifts, man. I'm on night shifts. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot. So I, I'm gonna donate a whopping one dollar per death. So I don't know if Rift is uh, is just trying to play me, kill Leo <laughs> like that. <laughs> Who else in chat wants to wants to do a dollar per death with me? I'll do five minimum. But yeah, so that's the whole idea. We're here to raise money uh, for uh, the Canadian Cancer Society and to show off this awesome game, so. Yeah, buddy, stick in the lips, get our shells wet and plomp it in the pond. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Joshua, thanks for the donut. Um, so, as he was talking about, so since we don't have Leo, we can't tank as much damage here. So likely he's probably just going to have to do some waiting yeah. in certain spots. Um, normally we would just fly through this section. Um, but 
it, it shouldn't be a, a huge <laughs> time waste. And yeah, I see uh, Streisers like in the uh, damn OST. It's one of the best songs ever. Yeah, I do. It's so good. We're gonna I go down and around this it. thing. I normally damage boost through this thing here as well, but <laughs> but you know, Leo. <laughs> right. Rip Leo. Oh. Rip Leo. <laughs> um so one one other interesting thing about the dam, they're actually currents um, that can give you boosts. Like if you see he starts moving a little faster there when he hits the the bomb. Um depending on your movements, uh, you do have some control over how to get those boosts. Um, bumping into a wall uh, typically oh, cancels no. <laughs> those boosts out. So, um, in a perfect world where we have all four turtles, um, we would be utilizing those. Uh, <laughs> to, to I don't know what to do without Leo. <laughs> yeah, just take your time. Take your time. You should be good now. You, you should be able to get through with only one more hit, likely. Damn. Get some blesses. Alright, getting through this part. He's gonna take at least one hit up here at the top. Um, at least a 99% chance. Maybe he'll get real lucky and not take any. No! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Alright, we got two. Hey, he's alive. He made it through. Good job, Rift. I am, okay. yeah, that was scary without Leo, I'll tell you. Hey, man, you did it. We got some safety pizza coming up, though. Yeah, buddy. I could take, I'm, I'm, I'm actually in a good position to take a, a game over here and just lock it in hole three. <laughs> yeah, it's worth considering. Uh, this is a good time for donos, if there's been any, uh, because it's also the uh, first look at the 3D television of 1989. <laughs> yeah, Ultra Games, they were they were forward thinkers. Um, while we're waiting to hear if we have any donations, uh, going a little deeper on that whole, whole three, whole one thing. So um, if he doesn't take a game over, once again, we've still got that chance of getting in the preferred whole, whole one. He does take a game over that's a guaranteed hole three which is by far the hardest hole to get through so pros and cons okay. so we did have a donation if i have a chance to read that excellent yeah okay so the donation comes from it looks like it is joshua 24 with ten dollars saying go get him riff awesome thanks joshua oh joshua safety pizza Put that so guy through the floor. <laughs> yeah. Do a little jump there and uh, spawns that guy right at the bottom. Now here's oh. another really nice clip we're going to do here. <laughs> Come on, Mikey! There it is. Oh, wait. All how right. much health do I have here? Oh, no. Death number two. <laughs> I'm not sure what the... I can stop a few times here. Yeah, you... Because, yeah, you might only be able to handle... You might not be able to take even one hit, so yeah, yeah, this should be interesting. This should be interesting. We might be doing this whole stage over again. Well, I have an Just idea, more, though. More bang for the buck. Is it going to be a surprise? No, no, it's going to be... What's he doing? Is he stomping? <laughs> what's he doing? <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah, freaking buddy. All right. Playing it safe. I like it. Brown chickens and cows. What do I do here? Like, Let's do this. Oh my gosh, he's right there. <laughs> oh, no. Rip Donnie. All Very right, so we're nice. taking the game over here. and <laughs> I, I respect you going for it. I've never done it like this. This is awesome. Cowabunga, guys. Four deaths. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sure, let's go with Mikey. So, minimal time loss, thankfully. Oh, this enemy set, fun. 
<laughs> so yeah, so that's another interesting thing. So we we do the speed run in a very particular way, killing certain enemies, making certain movements, and you can pretty much guarantee to see certain enemy patterns. So all that is up in the air now. So a lot of rooms have two different uh, enemy sets you can see, and uh, this is not the preferred set. No. no, I need to warp out with Mikey, and that would have been awesome. I'm too far to the, the right here. Fiery chicken legs. It's still too far. There we go. Sure, I have missiles. Uh, this enemy set's even hard to to, to die with. Here, here we go. <laughs> All right. Help you die. They We're back on die. track. I'm probably still going to show the whole one clip when we get there. That was something I wanted to show off. Yeah, that'd be cool. So I'll go to hole one anyway, even though we know the Technodrome is in hole three. There's a cool little clip we can show off there. And uh, this would actually be a decent time for uh, donations as well. Yeah. And singing. <laughs> Let's get it. Bam, check it, wow, you bud. So not a ton of optimization in this page or this stage. Um, you're really just trying to limit the number of sprites on screen to uh, reduce lag. Take the corners tight. And obviously, <laughs> don't blow through all of your missiles. Yeah. And despawn. Right. Just did a despawn. Got the despawn. What is this enemy set? Let's try something different. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> yeah, if you go out and go back in, you usually can uh, get it to reset. What about sewer rukins? No? Okay, hold on. Maybe we can get sewer rukins. I mean, what else could go wrong? <laughs> oh, man. What's this guy doing? Oh, my gosh. I stopped. <laughs> Wee. So, I will note you didn't park in the official turtle, turtle parking space. Oh, so I didn't! Maybe that's why you got the bad enemy pattern? Just yeah. Saying. I forgot about the official parking spot. Maybe that's why you didn't get sewer shurikens? Just saying. It's alright. Forgive me. I feel terrible. <laughs> I think that's a Nest Master thing. All right, coming up on the Mecha Turtle battle. Love this fight. So there's still a chance we could get a, a sub weapon, which could help make it a little bit faster. Um, and if he does get it, I'll, I'll be able to explain why. Yeah, very cool fight. Um, oh yeah. You oh, can get some. Oh, we got shurikens. All right. So we can do what's called a damage transfer. And basically, you start the attack quickly switch to your sub weapon and then switch back and it actually gives you the damage value of the sub weapon with your normal attack beautiful fight by the way thank you give it up for rift textbook yay something went right <laughs> <laughs> cowabunga uh, <laughs> yeah so have, having that shuriken that's um other than the scrolls that's the only um weapon that's useful uh, for the damage uh, transfer and scrolls will be seen here in a little bit, which deal much more damage. Shurikens just deal slightly more damage than uh, Donnie at less than half health. Yeah, I got the balloon pattern. All right, so we got the rope skip coming up here. <laughs> we got the ropes though for some reason. Oh, JK. So. Um, <laughs> You can actually skip this rope section uh, by damage boosting off some of the, the flying enemies. Um, incredibly tight trick, and it makes you lose a ton of time if you miss it. So, not uh, not safe for uh, for a marathon. So we got our first clip coming up. Give it a bounce. There's a hole in the ceiling. Oh boy. 
Chuck didn't stay in his corner, probably probably because I didn't use the parking spot. And now I'm, now, now I'm stuck on a ladder. Yeah, anything <laughs> bad that happens is because you didn't park in the official spot. <laughs> Does that clip have a name, by the way? Do you know? Uh, I don't r recall. <laughs> I don't think any of the clips have a name. We'll call it the grandma. Yeah, that sounds... Why? <laughs> why not? <laughs> why not? Alright, making our way through the airport here. It's gonna be says Spobble clip? Spobble? Yeah, I guess I don't know. that's who discovered it. Spobble. Okay. Um, so we're gonna be going through tons of rooms here. Um, very particular strategies. Um, looks like so far we are getting the um, desired enemy patterns. And we're going to be coming up on some really dangerous rooms. One of them is called the Death Room. As you can imagine, it's super easy. Need some luck for hole six here. Let's go. All right, be no good, rings man. in the face. Yeah, buddy. Ooh, hey, nice go go the back do, 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 do. Intentional spike walking. Huzzah. Yeah, buddy. Cowabunga. Let's go. Good hole six. Feels Beautiful. decent, man. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we'll we'll get a pizza refill here shortly, so he can Whoops. definitely afford to take some damage. Oh yeah. Playing this casually is a nightmare um, with so many different opportunities to go the wrong way. But luckily, we know where to go. Here we go, get some fireworks for Game Over Cancer. Woo! And just in time for a donation if you guys are up for it. Let's go. Yeah. Perfect. So we have a donation of $20 from Skunky48 saying, Thanks for showing off my favorite games. Brown chickens and cows, yeah, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, buddy. Thank you, Skunky. Awesome. And there we have the red clip. That one has a name. Red-headed uh, peckerwood. Yep. Got our scrolls out of the nice. death hole. made it through the death room. Yikes. Yeah, great work. There's another freaky jump at the end of this room here, too. Some damage with Mikey. Grab that pizza with Donnie. And then everybody hold your breath. Yeah, buddy! Let's go. The, the main reason I switched to Mikey for that room is to avoid getting another weapon drop that would take over from my scrolls. Oh, yeah, good point, right? Yeah. Whoa. Let's do this. Oh, and I Weapon still got shot with a laser. Um, what is it? Every 24, 23, 24 kills, you have a chance at a weapon drop. Shame pizza time. Let's go. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> hey, I, I'll, I'll be honest. I've, I've taken that shame pizza many times, so. Um, and we're out, out of the crushers and coming up on Mouser. And there is a glitch you can do here with the nudie pause. You pause at the exact right time. It's a very small window, I think two frames. Um, you can move his hitbox just above your head. And it'll stay active. Um, luckily, not much of a time loss when you miss it, because you can pause there as well to keep the hitbox active as he did, so great fight. I wasn't sure if I was going to make it or not. You can do it w w without if you're very precise, but mm -hmm. I thought pause would be accurate smart yeah. i don't know something good thanks for all the luck in chat guys let's and kick yeah, cancer's ass said, good scroll damage transfer so i'm going to show off this clip here in hole one we know the technodrome's not here but oh. if this guy would stop making there we go <laughs> Yeah, that little roly-poly guy likes to cause a lot of lag. I just... Oh. <laughs> Lol! <laughs> <That's> the... <laughs> well, I'm getting out of here. It. I've had enough. 
I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> don't death warp. <laughs> oh wait, I can't climb here. I gotta go this way. Now I'm gonna end up killing more dudes than I want to. So let's go over here. There's the worst enemy in the game. <laughs> yeah, it's this porcupine. Sonic. Sonic. Sonic the porcupine. I mean, yeah, I would say they're they're worse than the jet jetpack guys, which we're gonna be seeing here soon in the Technodrome. Thoughts? Oh, the jetpack dudes, yeah. I'd rather take two jetpack dudes versus one Sonic. <laughs> All right, so heading our way to hole three. He's got plenty of turtles to tank damage with. We're good to go. So while he's going through this, I was mentioning it earlier, but I think it's either 23 nice. or 24 enemies um, that you kill, you have a chance of getting a drop. So when you have Donatello, especially in the Technodrome, we got to be really careful. Um, and we have kind of planned out what enemies <laughs> we kill in certain orders. Nothing's working out here. <laughs> You're, fi you're fine, you got plenty of damage to tank still. Yeah. <laughs> um, to make sure that we don't get our scrolls replaced, because we will use that in the final hallway to, to fly through everything, so. Oh yeah, he's not gonna... <laughs> Triple Shurikens one-shots those guys? I mean, I knew that. I didn't know that. I, I Yeah, I had no idea. So Leo's the worst, just for the record. You know, everybody can have their preference on your favorite turtle, that's fine. But this game is the worst. What? Whoopsie doodle. So here, using that damage transfer again, especially with the scrolls, is a ton of work. And unfortunately, the eye of the Technodrome, which is how you kill it, um, is on a, a cycle based off the global timer, so... Yeah. Uh, not the best cycle we could have uh, hoped for, but we made made good work of it. I had an intentional pause and an accidental pause there. That's great. <laughs> intentional pause strats. Let's go. You are great! And this is the final battle. Get yourself a bowl of frosted flakes and a pizza. You have my support rift. Let's go. Galabunga. I like that screen. Whee. Once again, the, the goal here is to obviously survive, but get through with our scrolls intact. Got another beautiful clip coming up. And this one saves so much time, it's ridiculous. There's a hole in the ceiling here somewhere. I know there is. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, it's a pretty tight window for when you have to attack and you have to be in a very particular oh, yeah. position. Oh, um, oh, oh. Now you can soft lock the game um, if you come out of the, these clips wrong, so luckily we don't have any of that. No hamburger laser robot? That's just a good day. on the final room before we get to the final room and the uh, the hallway of Space Cowboys. I haven't seen a drop yet. Uh-oh. <laughs> Don't Maybe. drop. Here? No? All right. Here's All right, let's... It's wherever now. <laughs> He's doing particular jumps uh, to control where those uh, jetpack guys spawn. Let's go. Plus up. No drops. Let's go. Yay, yay. Beautiful. 
We have very little time, but I got to shout out Gondola as well. If you noticed, he was the holding gondola. down. There's our draw. Uh, <laughs> oh, beautiful. And red lightning for game over cancer. It's normally blue. But yeah, the gondola tech, like being able to move while swinging down is huge. Yeah, shout out to Mr. Dino for finding uh, the time. To the final and GG to Rift20XX. Beautiful Thanks, run. Crow. Overcoming lots of adversity. <laughs> Self made. 2350. You know what? Not bad for uh, what happened. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah. Cowabunga, folks. Night shift, too, Strizer says. <laughs> on, on night shift. <laughs> oh, man. How am I going to sleep? So much hype. Thank you all for the GGs in chat. Look, a lot of friendly faces in there. Yeah, so the last stage actually went really well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah very solid. Keeping those scrolls is tough. Yeah, great. Thanks. Awesome. Well, thank uh, you very, very much for that run. It was a blast to watch, deaths and all. You gotta love seeing turtles get squashed. <laughs> oh man, right off the hammer. Yeah, yeah uh, in and out of the uh, the hole and then immediately ran over. I, could, I couldn't get a control on my D-pad, I swear. I, I, <laughs> Made I, for a great start. I was shook up because I forgot, I was so concentrated on the audio cue, I forgot to tell you guys when the timer starts. And so I was already like, messing up I'm like oh yeah timer's supposed to start i'm stuck in this hole though uh, now i'm just gonna run over here and get squashed <laughs> and then the uh panic underwater level with very little health and very few turtles yeah not having leo to tank that first leg of the of the underwater relay was was uh a lot of improvising there it's usually Definitely. oh i died let's reset the video game <laughs> but <laughs> This was awesome. Not uh, so much in marathons. Not so much in marathons. No, this is a, this is a, a exciting marathon game for all sorts of reasons. Uh, anyway, thanks, uh, the thanks to just Riser and everybody else in the background putting this event to, to together. It was a pleasure to uh, participate in it. Uh, thanks to all the, the viewers and donators and posts and all that stuff guys this is uh this is awesome let's kick cancer's ass agreed agreed so we're gonna get uh geared up here for our next run so stick around folks and thanks again for the rough or the uh, run and the uh, commentary <laughs> awesome take care <laughs> folks great job riff yeah. thanks man <laughs>